Hey there, this is Michelle Pesco Solito. And so in this training video, we're gonna talk about how to actually create a true split test using Facebook ads. So I'm gonna go into just creating a traffic ad for this example. And when you come down and you've, you know, you, you come down to the section here where you're gonna set up um, campaign budget optimization or create a split test, you cannot choose both of these as of this time. So right now, what we wanna do is uh, we wanna create a split test. So basically what this is, is it's an A-B test. You can either test your creative, you can do the placements, you can do your audience, you can even do delivery optimization strategies. Now, um, what I like about this is, is it's actually Facebook doing the split testing for you. In the past, we would have to create our own split test, be able to analyze the data ourselves and determine the winner. But by choosing this little radio dial over to the right, um, you'll be able to use Facebook's platform to actually create this split test for you. So let me show you what that's gonna look like. So let's just say we want to actually um, do delivery optimization. So we're gonna choose that and then we'll click continue. And then from there, it's just like setting up any other ad. You're just going to kind of go through this and here are your variables. All right. So we chose delivery optimization and now we've got to set that up. So our first choice for ad set A is landing page views. Now down here for ad set B, I want to do link clicks. All right, so now we've got three different ad sets that are going to, or two different ad sets that are going to run against each other in a true split test that Facebook's going to do. Now, if you want to add another variable in, you just click test another one. And now let's just say I want to do um, impressions. All right, so now I'm running a split test between three different ad sets. And from there, you're just going to go through everything else. You're going to create your audience, and this is going to be the same among all these three different ad sets. You're going to set up your targeting, the placements, but you're going to come down here, and this is a little bit different. So what you're going to want to do is you want to tell Facebook how long you want to actually split test for. So what's great is they give you this little guide here. So let's just say I put in $30. You can see that it's going to run for four days. And I'll spend no more than $120, but my estimated test power is only 67%. So the power is the likelihood of detecting a difference in your ad sets if there is one to detect. So we really want to get that at 100%. So we may need to raise our budget to do that. So let's go to 200. All right, so now we're in the green. So we're 88%, Facebook is 88% likely going to be able to detect a difference and give us a winner. So the more variables you put in, the more your budget is going to have to be in order to get that up to green. So if I go up here and I actually close this one out and maybe we just want to test two variables, you can see we're up to 94%. So what's going to happen is, is after four days, Facebook's going to come back to you and they're going to tell you, hey, this ad set A was the clear winner. Do you want to keep running this ad and you'll be able to continue running the ad? So this is a really great feature. It takes kind of that guesswork out of us trying to figure out how to split test ourselves, which I do that on my own also. There's a lot of business owners that also do that, but it's kind of fun to test this out and have Facebook actually do it, use their sophisticated algorithm to determine which one is the better performing ad set or ad. Um, so let me go back up here. And let me just show you, so like we can even do placement. You can do audience. So maybe you want to test different audiences against each other. So you can come in here. And maybe I want to test um, this lookalike audience in this ad set. And then in this ad set, I want it to be um, warm 90 MVD. So now I've created a split test. Two different ad sets. Again, as I said before, when you come down here, it's going to run for four days or maybe it's going to be two days and it's going to let me know the actual estimated test power. And then from there, we just kind of wait on Facebook to come back with the results and uh, just analyze it. They'll give you, you know, an idea of why it won and you just decide for yourself if you want to continue running that ad. So this is a really great feature. I encourage everybody to use this. So if you got a lot of value from this, definitely like this video share it, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and I'll see you in the next training video. Bye-bye.